In this video, we are going to solve problem F3-6 from R.C. Heffeler Engineering Statics 12 edition. According to this problem, determine the tension in cables AB, BC and CD necessary to support the 10 kg and 15 kg traffic lights at D and C respectively. Also find the angle theta. To solve this problem, first of all we have to draw the free body diagram of point B and C so for point C we have I have one vertical force downwards I have one force at some angle theta I have one force going in negative x direction which is positive y negative y positive x negative x this point right here is C let's call this this force WC this point D ECD this point B EBC this is at some angle theta so the equilibrium equations of force is sum of fx equal 0 this direction positive so I have one component of TCD this direction and one component parallel to y axis I have TC dy TC dx ECD cos theta minus EBC equals 0. This is our first equation. For second equation, sum of forces in Y equals 0. We are taking up direction positive. So I have ECD sin theta minus wc equal 0 ecd sin theta equal the mass of the traffic light is given which is 15 kg into 9.81 equal 147.15 now this is the second equation equation 2 now let's draw the free body diagram of point B so we could obtain two more equations to solve these unknowns I have free body diagram of point B I have one force directed downwards the weight of the traffic light at point B one force going in this direction another force is inclined at 15 degrees this is WB this is point B point C point A 15 degrees TAB also I have to resolve this TAB force I have one component parallel to Y axis and one component parallel to X axis so this is TABY TAB X positive x negative x 
positive pi negative pi now sum of forces in x direction equals 0 I have TBC minus TAB cos 15 degree equals 0 BBC equals TAB cos 15 degrees this is our third equation fourth equation is sum of forces in y direction equals 0 I have TAB time 15 degrees minus WB equals 0 TAB equals the mass of the traffic light B is given which is 10 times 9.81 divided by sine 15 TAB equal 379 newtons this is our first answer now I can put the value of TAB into equation 3 to get TBC put TAB in equation 3 this equation EBC equals 379 cos 15 degrees EBC equals 366.114 newtons this is our second answer now I can put the value of TBC into equation 1 this equation so I have put TBC equals 366.114 in equation 1 then I have ECD cos theta ECD cos theta equals 366.114 Newtons. This is the six point one one four newtons. We have another equation right here. Let's call this equation A. So we have directly DCD sine theta equals one forty seven point fifteen degrees. This is our second equation. I am seeing sin theta and cos theta if I divide these two equations and I can get rid of this TCD and can easily find this angle theta to divide equation 2 by A I have TCD sin theta over TCD cos theta equals 147.15 degrees divided by 366.114 newtons will cancel out sin theta over cos theta equals 10 theta equals 147.15 over 366.114 theta equals 21.9 degrees now I can put this theta into this equation equation A put the value of theta in equation A so I have TCD equals 366.114 over cos 21.9 degrees 
ECD equals 394.6 Newtons. This is our third answer. This is our fourth answer. In order, if we solve it in the order of the question. I hope you will find this video helpful. If you have any problem, any suggestions, you can write them down in the comment section and I will answer them as soon as possible. I hope you will like this video and please subscribe and like this channel for daily updates. Thank you.